This rapper says he's richer than Mr. Beast and he's flexing like crazy to prove his point. Latino rapper Dan Sir started a wild beef with Mr. Beast after calling him out for not having any bling. But it gets worse, since Dan later accused Mr. Beast fans of vandalizing his cars. No sé cómo supieron que era mi carro. Mira cómo me lo rayonearon los seguidores de Mr. Beast. Viva Mr. Beast. But this isn't even the craziest part about him, because he did the most insane thing ever and took flexing to a whole new level after he surgically implanted expensive chains into his head just so he could rock some shiny golden locks. So this guy has these yeah. gold chains Dreads. inserted into his head? And these chains aren't cheap. Tengo tres Bugattis en la cabeza. Yo no los manejo. Yo los tengo en puro oro en la cabeza. But things get even crazier since he's constantly bragging about being friends with megastars like Peso Pluma and even said that Messi was his cousin which he tried to prove with this video. Un abrazo grande a Van Sur. Besitos de oro. Le dicen el más millonario del universo. Turns out he just paid a viral Messi lookalike to record this message. But that's the kind of crazy stuff anyone would do if they had an insane amount of money to spend. And you're probably wondering whether everything he flexes is real, but it definitely is, since Dan's making over a million dollars every single year. And he's already got a net worth of over 12 million dollars, which is completely insane since he's only 24 years old. But nobody knows how he's actually making his money, since he was blinged out way before he went viral on the internet, and it's not just the chains on his head. Dan's flexing with crazy grills, iced out jewelry, and luxury cars most people can only dream of, which is why nobody really understands why Dan's tweaking on the internet and beefing with random influencers instead of just chilling with his wealth. But they also think he needs to focus a little more on his career, since he only has a few thousand listeners a month. However, Dan's not just a flexer, he tries to give back to the community whenever he can. Yet, people still can't stand his obscene amount of wealth and the way he flexes it. Boy, is this guy out his rabbit ass mind? What would you have to go through in your life to think it's a good idea to implant gold change in your head permanently? I mean, that's easy to understand when your favorite rapper's paying messy impersonators just to get some clout. But despite all those jokes and comments, Dan's thriving online with over 7 million followers on TikTok. Which means that he's got an audience that loves keeping up with his out-of-pocket antics. So is Dan Sir Beast just a rich guy who's bored out of his mind, or is he simply the best flexer we've ever seen?